Well, a no-show from the owner of a company at the center of two controversial photos. Employees from American Sewer Services were fired because of those pictures. That's why Milwaukee's Common Council wanted to question the company's owner today, but he missed a scheduled meeting. Brandon Rook live in downtown to explain. Charles and Shannon, that meeting was actually supposed to happen last week, but it was rescheduled for today because the owner had some health concerns. Now, those health concerns caused him to miss today's meeting, and city leaders are extremely disappointed. Instead, a statement was read by American Sewer Services project manager Dan McClendon. In the letter, the owner spoke out against recent incidents involving his employees. Within two weeks, the company has been caught on camera brandishing guns at a work site. And another employee was seen with a KKK sticker on his lunch cooler. City leaders have even received racist and hateful emails and calls for speaking out against this. The owner also condemned the hate the aldermen received. These actions have sparked a rally in the city. I much rather would have wished to have the owner there to answer questions because even within the statement, it's um, several questions that I had. The statement also says they're currently updating their company policies and workers cannot carry guns on City of Milwaukee project sites. It's important to note the company said employees who choose to carry guns aren't just doing it in Milwaukee. They're also carrying them in surrounding suburbs, which some were surprised by. If you're not police or military, I don't understand why you would need a gun to do your job. The owner also says that he would like to meet with certain city council members individually on a face to face basis. But some city leaders say that they are still going to try to legally subpoena him to appear in front of the committee live from City Hall. I'm Brandon Rook today's TMJ4. All right. Thanks for following through, Brandon.